Statistically, there will be a shooting in Boston tomorrow. 1% of the city's youth is responsible for more than 70% of gun violence and more than 50% of homicides. There are 240 young people that the community is labeled as the most likely to shoot or be shot. I visited these young people in the hospital. I've had to go to funerals for teenagers, and we've trained young people in prison. We've seen the almost impossible barriers that they face, but with the help and support of inner city weightlifting, we've seen our students succeed despite the odds. We work to reduce youth violence by getting these young people off the streets and into the gym, where they're empowered with the confidence and support needed to say no to violence and yes to opportunity. Research from Crime and Justice Institute suggests that there are four big risk factors for criminal behavior. Antisocial personality, are they impulsive? Antisocial peers, are their friends breaking the law? Antisocial attitude, are they stuck in the streets? And antisocial behavior, are they breaking the law? In order for a young person in our program to succeed in academics or the workforce, we must simultaneously address these risk factors. We start simply by decreasing time on the street. We've created an overwhelmingly positive and supportive atmosphere that our students seek out by choice. Once in the gym, we leverage this time to increase pro-social choices. A student comes to the gym and sees their friend making positive decisions, and they see an adult who they've come to respect supporting those decisions. A path to change comes to focus. Once we've established this trust, we're able to refer our students to any number of our networking partners and our in-house career track and personal training. In this career track, students not only discover a viable option that they enjoy and pays well above a reasonable living wage, but most important, a career path that deepens them in the support system that's helped guide them through the most difficult decision points. One of our students is known by the community as a high impact player. Frank has lost friends and family to the streets and life in prison and he himself has been shot. Today, he's on the longest stretch of his life, one year, one month, out of prison and off probation. He's studying to become a personal trainer, he's training clients, and he's helping guide students younger than him in a positive direction. The other day, someone asked him what inner city weightlifting means to him. He replied, it means a lot to me. They're like my friends, my family. They've been there for me and my friends when no one else has. We have much love for those guys. It's transformation like this that makes inner city weightlifting so special, where all of a sudden our students find themselves with pro-social peers, pro-social attitude, and pro-social behavior. We launched January 2010 with four students. Today, we've seen more than 200 students walk in through our doors. Our recidivism rate for our active target students is 18.9% compared to an expected 44% within first year of release. Most important, our net promoter score, meaning how likely it is that one of our target students will refer a friend, is 100%, meaning that we're no longer working with an individual, but we're changing the dynamics of the entire group. Today, the biggest struggle we face is meeting the demand for our program. In the past three months, Two of our recruits have been killed. These are young people who wanted to be in inner city weightlifting. Sadly, we didn't have the time, space, or capacity to work with these young people. We are not an organization looking to grow for the sake of growing. We're looking to grow because we need to. And we ask for your help tonight in building our capacity to help us provide positive opportunity for young people who need it the most. $140,000 allows us to staff our newly dedicated training center with extended hours with our students. $20,000 allows us to bring on an additional coach to work with our students in and outside the gym. And for just $20, and I hope everyone takes me up on this offer. I know some of you out there have already you can purchase a personal training session with one of our students, where you'll not only get a high quality workout, but you'll directly impact the life of a young person. 
We hope to see you at our booth after the presentations to learn more about inner city weightlifting and to help us achieve our vision to end youth violence so that no longer do our students find themselves isolated on the streets, but instead overwhelmed with support. Thank you.